This is Rebecca Marina Messenger. I'm broadcasting from my hotel room. I'm traveling, but a darling lady who saw one of my videos about getting pregnant, TTC, sent me an urgent message. Oh, please, where's the instructions about anxiety around getting pregnant, trying to conceive? So, I have two treatments that work very effectively. Now, you might have to do them today, and you might need to do some tomorrow. But the greatest detriment to getting pregnant is what? The freaking anxiety. How do I know this? Because years ago, I thought I was done having children, and I had my tubes burnt and cauterized, never knowing that I was going to become divorced, marry a man eight and a half younger years younger than me and guess what he wanted babies this was 30 years ago i had the surgery to reconnect my tubes which 30 years ago it was in its infancy and the chances were not great but at that time i was so desperate and ladies you know what i'm saying when i say desperate my biological clock was ticking i was 35 Five, 36 when I had the surgery then I had miscarriages but I got introduced to the mind body spirit concept it actually changed my life now I'm a spiritual healer and it led to all kind of things good things but I became certified I was so sold because guess what I had two beautiful children and I was so sold on these mind, body, spirit techniques that I became certified and at least five of them cost me thousands of dollars. But just go along with me as I guide you in a treatment for your anxiety. It's going to be using the acupressure points. I'm not going to make this real long so that you have to learn acupressure. You just do what I do. First of all, close your eyes and think about your anxiety about being able to get pregnant. Or maybe you're trying to adopt. Whatever it is, the anxiety just keeps the baby at bay. So it, it keeps you from relaxing. It blocks you in all kind of ways. So we're going to do some tapping on acupressure meridians. Here we go. All you do is tap and tap where I tap and you repeat what I say. Now, think about your anxiety on a scale of 1 to 10. How high is your anxiety? Is it a 5, a 6, a 7, or 8? Make a note of it right now before we start the exercise. So, Repeat after me. Tap right here. This is a spot for self-sabotage. And don't you ever feel like your body is sabotaging you, like tricking you one month, you think you're pregnant, and then you have your period. It's horrible. So tap right here and repeat after me. Even though I have anxiety, say that, about ever having a baby, I love and accept myself. And that's where it's important that you love and accept yourself and stop blaming yourself for having this anxiety. And repeat it again, even though I'm terrified I'm never going to have a baby of my own. I love and accept myself. Just take a deep breath in and out. I'm terrified. I'm never going to have a baby of my own. Now, you're going to tap right here, and we're going to shorten it down. It's very important that you do this with me. Terrified I'll never be pregnant. Four acupressure meridians come here. Now, see the beginning of your eyebrow. It doesn't matter which side. They're both the same. Terrified I'll never be pregnant. Terrified. I'll never be pregnant. Here, just hold that for a moment. This is a spot for fear and anxiety, the biggest spot on all your whole body. And just take a deep breath in and out. Terrified. 
I'm never going to have my own baby. Then underneath the nose, let me see if I can do this. Terrified, I'm never going to have my own baby. Terrified, right under the lip here. Terrified, I'm never going to have my own baby. And then here, see, just see this hollow here. Terrified, I'm never going to have my own baby. And then underneath the armpit, terrified. I'm never going to have a baby of my own. And then just take a deep breath in and out. And that was a quickie, but tune into your level of anxiety. <sighs> Feeling a little better? Now, we're going to put in a positive choice. My darling friend, Dr. Patricia Carrington, who is a psychologist, PhD, and everything else, came up with this method. She's certified in this too, and which is a positive choice. So, a positive choice would be, even though I have this anxiety, I choose to have a positive outlook, or I choose to feel better right now. So let's come back. We're going to tap here again. Even though I still have some anxiety, remember it's important that you do it with me. I still have some anxiety. I choose to just relax. I know it'll all work out. Now go to the top of the head. I choose to just relax. I like sometimes to tap on both, especially when we got all this anxiety going on, right ladies? I choose to just relax. I choose to just relax. I'm releasing this anxiety. And just hold that and breathe in and out. <sighs> Choose to just relax. I'll try to move my. Choose to just relax. Choose to just relax. And then under the armpit, choose to just relax. Take a deep breath in and out. And tune in to where your anxiety is now. Now, I'm going to give you another method, and that's called heart point technique which is a method given to me by the Divine Mother. And it doesn't matter what faith you are or not. Um, this method is wonderful. So the way it works is that you stream light from your higher self point, which is 8 to 10 inches above your head, and you bring that light down through your crown and through the corpus callosum and all the acupressure regions around your eyes that we just tapped on, all you use is your imagination and then down into your heart. So it helps if you hold some hand positions. You don't have to. I'm going to show you and then take them off because um, you probably like talking to me better if, if you can see me. So one position is here. Another is here. Now what this does is connects your heart and your head together. So go ahead and put your hands in that position and close your eyes. And we're just going to bring in some healing light down into your heart center. Some healing, calming light. So close your eyes hands in the position if you would like. All you do is listen to the sound of my voice and imagine that above your head there is this beautiful peaceful light gathering and the peaceful light brings love, peace, comfort down through your crown. The light begins to pour into your crown. 
and then all throughout your cranial cavity. It streams downward to your heart, to the innermost recesses of your heart. And it just brings you into a peaceful, loving state. And just imagine that you see that scared little part of you that's terrified you're never going to have a baby of your own. Or maybe you have one and you're terrified you're never going to have another. Maybe you have some guilt plaguing you from some, who knows, guilt creeps in about everything. So imagine that part of you is in a circle of light and that scared, terrified little part of you, you're just streaming that divine light from your heart out. And just see that little part of you accepting this healing. And while you're streaming this healing light, why not bring it on down to your fallopian tubes, to your womb, to your eggs, to everything having to do with reproduction. Why not send a stream of that light out to your partner, to their sperm, to the motility, to the strength of the sperm. And if you're trying to adopt, send that stream of healing light out to that other scared person, that other woman that's going to have to give up her child. Don't you know she feels scared? Do you think any woman alive says, oh goody, I'm going to get pregnant and then I'm just going to give it away? No. And while we're streaming that healing light, stream it to the baby, the spirit that's already picked you. Because it's my firm belief that if you are desiring a baby, it's because the spirit that wants you to be the mama has already picked you. So, Eliminating your anxiety helps. So those are two treatments that I think you'll find very helpful. And I do have programs because I am certified and so many techniques that can help. I have a lot of programs that can help you get your baby quicker. And I have helped women. And I have help from the other side because my mother, who had eight children of her own, she is so willing to help us from the other side. So there'll be a link below that you can click on if you'd like more information and if you'd like to discover if one of my programs is right for you. Whether you do or not, please come back to this video whenever you feel anxiety and if there's another kind of concern that you have that I could make a video for you about leave it in the comment section while you're here subscribe to my channel this is Rebecca Marina messenger and I'm sending you big baby hugs by the way you're gonna be the best mama ever. I don't care if your mama wasn't so hot or some people are afraid of that. I got a program for that too and it's free. But you are destined to be a great mama. Bye-bye.